talk about a match. You don't even care I lost big. Alrighty. Hello once again, everybody. Blitzball Champ is back. Continuing on with my Final Fantasy VII Remake playthrough. We're at part eight. And um Yeah, it's good to be it's good to be back on here. Hope everybody's been doing well. Hope everybody's had a great week. But um Yeah. We are here, we are live. Hold on a few things. Just wanna check something right quick. Okay, there we go. I just had just had to make sure everything was good on that part. Okay. Let's go ahead and uh, switch this to uh, full screen. All right. So, a uh, few things I wanted to uh, point out. Um, so, as you can see, I grind it like crazy. Um, and both Cloud and Aerith are at uh, level 50, which level 50 is the max level for this game. Um, so, I'm at level 50. Another thing I wanted to show was that I also got a... I sent in another receipt for the, um, the candy bar um, DLC thing. Uh, special going on and I was finally able to get the um, the Mako crystal I don't know if that was something that I uh, got last time or not um, I don't exactly remember but I felt like I point, should point this out so I got all the DLC now so really cool also Still can't believe so the last thing that I did was I got through the, the Battle Coliseum, defeated the Hell House, and, you know, won the whole tournament and everything. And I am able to go ahead and spend the money to uh, get Aerith's dress. Before I do that, there's a few things I want to try to do. I want to... Well, first, I want to show y'all the uh, Battle Coliseum. Because apparently, once you complete... Battle Coliseum, then it unlocks some extra battles that you can do. So I'm gonna show you those battles. They're fairly simple, so I'll just go ahead and show you, show them to you, just so that y'all will know what they look like. And this is actually a really, really great way to grind with Cloud and Aerith, and um, you know, get them leveled up, and also, you know, level up your materia as well. So I highly recommend uh, use, utilizing the Battle Arena, the Battle Coliseum, um, as much as possible. It does cost per fight, but it's only like 100 to 200 gil. So, I mean, you can easily earn that back. So, it's no big deal. But yeah, here's the guy you talked to. Hey, been waiting for you. So, what are you in the mood to fight? So... Right now, I only have access to three battle challenges. Um, you have one where it's Cloud against wild animals. You have one where it's Aerith against wild animals, which means you um, play as those characters uh, solo. And then you have the two-person team versus the slum outlaws, where it, you can uh, take a team of two 
and in this in this battle. So um, I'm gonna select this one just to just to show you what it's like. And you can pick any difficulty. You can do classic, easy, and normal. I've done this both on easy and normal, um, but I'll just pick normal for the heck of it. And then you pick your you pick your team leader, and then your uh, your teammate, which you know, Cloud and Era. Then you can begin the the challenge. So yeah, I'll just get this get through this right quick, just so that you'll see what it looks like. So yeah, it's just five rounds, and you know once you win five five battles, you pretty much you win. And you know you get experience and items and stuff per battle, you know AP per battle. So this all counts. And the cool thing about this is whether you do this on easy or normal, you still get the same amount of um, AP and experience. So, you, know, you could take advantage of that and you know, grind and do a bunch of these on easy difficulty and really grind that way. Nothing to it, you know, for experience sake. So, you got some options. Yeah, these, these bandits like to drop uh, uh, shock mines, and if you touch them, they stun you. Other than that, there's not really any big deal. It's your turn. I got this. Uh, and I just got shocked by that. This one's for you. Yeah, and the bandits can steal as well. Actually, let me get close. I'm backing off a bit. Bye bye. That wasn't so bad. I think that's pretty cool that you get some get HP and MP recovery after the fight. Wow. Here it comes. And then there's one more fight, which is pretty much some bandits and a, and a shield, shield hunter, hunter, hunter marksman. I'll take care of them. You can do it! Take it over. Over here! It's on now. There we go, and that's pretty much it. So that's just a sample. Was never in doubt. And see, for rewards, you get all all sorts of different items. It's not the same each time, uh, but yeah, you get all sorts of items, and and yeah, it just takes you back there. Now. When I did Cloud and Arifs, they actually gave me their le their level two limit breaks for completing those two. So I now um, have their level two. Come limit back breaks. anytime you want to fight. So you look at battle settings. You can see I have Ascension and Cross Slash. So Ascension I got from this battle arena and Planet Protection. 
you know, for for Aerith. But yeah, that's that's pretty much uh, the the battle arena. But yeah, that's how how I spent my time grinding. So I highly, highly suggest uh, doing this. But uh, cool deal. So I also want to check some of those alleyways to see if maybe those items are available now. Because thing is, when I go ahead and go and get Arif's dress, I think that's pretty much it for this area. And then I have to proceed. So yeah, let's um, let's see if I can get any of those other items, and then I'll restructure my materia, and then we will proceed. What's this guy got to say? Congratulations on winning the tournament! You're an impressive fighter. I know that you'll be a great influence on my Johnny. Why, you might even end up having a friendly rivalry. You can spur each other to greater heights. I can see it. You two will become great friends. The best of friends. <laughs> uh... Maybe. But, whatever. But yeah, let me see if I can actually try to get some of those items. I don't quite remember where all of them are, but I could probably figure it out. Okay. I think maybe... Was one over here? Perhaps? Oh no, that, that was the, the dude that kept getting sick. Okay, so not that one. Now I gotta try to go, try to go back and find where those spots were. Cause this wall market is so freaking huge. Uh, I just came through that way. Sorry, buddy. More drinks. You tell me. That's the only I'm so excited. Oh, maybe. This way was one of them. Let's see what we have. Marlita's the greatest honey girl there ever was. It's an undisputed. Yes, who? It's always best to be prepared for the worst, wouldn't you agree? Quality monster insurance is more essential than ever these days. Dang. Well, I guess, I guess I can't get through. No, oh well. No You've lost your marbles, man. I might as well just go ahead and restructure my materia and proceed. Wait. So let's let's go ahead and do that. Yeah, let's go ahead and do that. Uh, hmm. uh let's just remove all this. Yeah, let's just start from scratch. All right, cloud. Actually, let's do air first. Um, let's give her a healing. Also gonna give her. I thought I had more HP ups. Apparently I don't. Yeah, I'll give you an HP and an MP up. Why not? Yeah. Let's give her a heal.
Actually, let's put it in that slot. Uh. Hmm. I kind of want to pair her with some materia. I just don't know what. Oh, definitely want to keep her on prayer. Prayer. Cleansing. just make her my main healer. Yeah, I'll just I'll just make her my main healer. Survival and uh, let's give her something else. Give her item item master. Or I could give her the, the refoc refocus limit break. Maybe. Uh probably not her. Uh could give her a large ATB increase. I could also give her the assess materia as well. Nah. Uh, I'll give her bear. I'll give her barrier. Yeah. Yeah, she'll be my main healer buff buffer. Cloud. Let's see. The cloud. Uh Let's give him I definitely want the assess materia. I definitely want to. Definitely want to MP up. Yeah. Uh. That. Assess. Let's give him. Elemental fire, because I still need to level up elemental. And uh, I could try to steal some stuff where I can use the magic up materia. Full first strike.
expands the range of spells. Allows an ally to follow the leader's attack command with an attack from late materia. How about this? Let's do... Because I kind of want to do a magic boost. This, this ATB boost may come in handy as well. There's one thing I gotta keep in mind. Uh... Here, let's do this. Let's do an ice. And let's do... ATB boost. Okay. I think that should be fine. I think that honestly should be fine. And then... Need to go ahead and... I guess I might as well go ahead and do Tifa's and, and Barrett's. Uh, let's see. Yeah, she had Chakra. Let's see, that's the thing. She has... Let's see, I gotta give them better equipment. Hold up. We still got the leather. Brace, bracers. Could give them titanium bangles. Yeah. See if I can get a another titanium team. bangle from the shop, the yeah. and then I'll get that Tifa. Then I should be fine. Yeah, weapon shop should be up here. Yeah, weapon and armor shop. Oh, it's right here. Dur, dur, dur. Okay. I'm doing that. Welcome to Walmart's Open premier weapon finger. shop. Yeah. Open up my delicious butterfinger. Take a bite. Hmm. Hmm. Very good.
Or actually, I could get a studded bracer. Yeah, I'll get another studded bracer. Why not? Get rid of these iron bangles. I don't even need them anymore. Yeah, let's get rid of these. Yeah. Let's get rid of these. Do come again. All right. about giving Barrett one, but uh, I mean, no, nah, I think he'll be fine. I think he'll be fine. Okay, Let's give these folks some materia. Uh, let's see, what does Barrett have for choke bow? Yeah. What are the other ones I have? Okay. Actually, you know what? You take lightning. Yeah, you take lightning. Barrett. Actually, Tifa, I'm gonna give you ice. I'm gonna make you ice, ice based. So, definitely gonna give you chakra. Yep, chakra. Um, I could give you steel as well. I can make you the thief of the group. Why not? Sure. Let's see. I'm gonna give you ice. Where's that ice material? There it is. Yeah, there it is. Um, let's give it some sort of enhancement. Uh, sure. Why not? Uh, let's give you. Give you an MP up, sure. Um, what else? Uh, guess we could give you deadly dodge. I need to get two more, uh, I need to get two, no, I need to get three more HP ups and two more MP ups. Or wait, no, I need to get one more MP up and three more HP ups at some point. Um, 
Well, I do have another... I do, I do have another spare healing materia that I could use. Uh... What the heck? Let's give her... Let's give her poison and something else. Poison and luck up, sure. I don't care. Alright, bear it. Let's we'll give you the other healing material. Why not? Actually. Put it in this slot. And then we're gonna give you We'll give you wind as well. Why not? Uh, uh, let's give you first strike, steadfast block. Give him the binding materia, I guess. Or the refocus. Eh, I'll give him the binding materia. Sure. Yeah, I, I need to get another MP up. Actually, I'm a switch. Mm, she can do two, he can do three. Yeah, I'm a switch. Get, you get Tifa's MP up. Yeah, you get Tifa's MP up. I think this will balance it out. Yeah. I think this will balance it out. Bam! Okay. Okay, I'm set now. Let me use the let me use the hotel room to rest, and then I promise you we'll we'll proceed. Yes. Have a safe trip. All right. Let's proceed. So, where are the ships? I've seen the old. So, we need to go to the uh We need to go to the um what you call it? The massage parlor. 
I can remember where that is. Ah, there it is. All right, Madam M. It's your gorgeous self. Let's go. You're here. Good. I have everything I need to get started. Just one thing before we do. You're the Cloud, right? Cloud the Merc. I'm told you did a wonderful job helping the people of Sector 5. <laughs> you have a very impressive work ethic. It's like they say, good things come to those who work. What goes around, comes around. And in ways that might surprise you. <laughs> I'm gonna put Aerith in the most gorgeous dress you've ever seen. <laughs> It'll be a real jaw-dropper. Alright, now that that's out of the way, once you change, you won't be able to leave town. Are you sure you're ready? Yes. Alright then, let's get started. Beauty takes a lot of work and preparation. Far more than you'd know. In the meantime, let me see, let me think. <laughs> you look like you haven't experienced the best of what this town has to offer. That really won't do. Not interested. <laughs> then maybe you can show the town what you have to offer instead. Which is to say... Why don't you try putting those finely honed mercenary skills of yours to good use here, in Wall Market? I have a few little requests that you might be able to help out with. <laughs> I gave that hand extra special treatment. Now get out there and show me what you can do with it. <laughs> and that's enough of that. Eric, come with me. Oh boy, I can't wait to see the dress. The dress is part of it, sure. But we'll also need to do something about that plain Jane makeup and hairdo. This is gonna take some work. Ouch! Well, I'll see you later, Cloud. Peek, and I'll poke out your eyes. Jeez. <laughs> Don't worry, I won't peek. It's cool. It's cool. Okay. So I got, I got some jobs to do. Okay. All right, let's see what we have on the menu. Burning thighs. Price of thievery. So two right now, eh? And I'm sure there'll be more. Okay. Let's 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 do this. Let's 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 do this. No idea what to expect. Let's see what we can do. Looks like it's over here. Oh. Okay. Cloud, been waiting for you to show up. Thanks for coming, and welcome to our humble training hall. Jules, head trainer. If you've got some time to spare, how about a little bit of fun? Want to try taking on one of our guys? <laughs> You're not serious, are you? Look at him. He's a scrawny little thing. I can snap him like a twig. Now, now. I wouldn't judge this one by his muscle mass. What do you say, Cloud? If you want to give it a go, just let me know. I think we're talking about squats. That's what counts. So, you up for a round? Oh. So there's different ranks. Training, three mega potions. Amateur, an orb of luck up materia. And pro, champion belt. 
All right. Ha! You're taking me on? You look like a dried up old perpsicold left out in the sun. You got no idea what you're getting into, little man. All right, enough talk. We'll settle this the tried and true traditional way. A squat off. Now, let's all see what you've got. All right, how do we do this? Okay. Perform more squats than your opponent in the allotted time to win. In the event of a tie, you will lose. Dang. Follow the on-screen guide and press the corresponding buttons at the right moment to perform squats. As you proceed, the guide will gradually fade from view and you will have to watch Cloud's movements to determine to when to press the appropriate buttons. Oh, jeez. With each successful squat, your pace will increase along with the speed with which you have to respond. However, acting too slowly or too quickly will cause you to stumble. Oh, jeez. So. When competing against more skilled opponents, Cloud will grow more fatigued. The chance that he may get caught in the sticking point will increase. When this happens, you must press the corresponding button repeatedly until the gauge is filled. Poorly timed button presses build more fatigue than perfect ones. Oh, jeez. Now don't go crying to mom. All right, let's try. <laughs> That's how it's done. <laughs> I knew you could do it. You got this. Come on. Your form's looking good. Not bad at all. You got this. Come on. I knew you could do it. Your form's looking good. That's how it's done. You've got this, come on! Not well, bad at all. I knew yeah. you could do it! Your form's looking good! You've got this, come on! I knew yeah. you could do it! Not well, bad at all. That's how yeah. it's done. I knew you could do it! Not well, bad at all. Your form's looking good! You've got yeah. this, come on! Not well, bad at all. I knew yeah. you could do it! That's how it's done. Your form's yeah. looking good! You've got this, come on! I knew you could do it! That's how it's done! Not yeah. bad at all! I knew you could do it! That's yeah. how it's done! Okay, that was way too freaking easy. never in doubt. That was way too easy. <laughs> yeah. What's up, Sonata number eight? That was way too easy. <laughs> Ronnie is How the hell did I lose to this scrawny little kid who looks like he doesn't even consume his daily recommended amount of protein? Ronnie, you know it's all about quality, not mass. You're too quick to judge people by their build. That and your overtrained ego are the main reasons you lost to our bold challenger here. <laughs> Thanks for helping me teach my boys a valuable lesson. And sorry for dragging you into it. Cloud? We're all one big family here at this gym, and now you're part of it. If you're ever up for training, our doors are always open to you. Let's work together to maintain healthy minds and bodies. Okay, so unlock the other difficulty. Oh, okay. Fair enough. If you're ever in the mood for another workout, just talk to Jay or Ronnie. Which one's Jay? Is this Jay? You wanna go, do ya? Alright then, bring it on! Okay. Let's see if he's tougher. Are you ready for this? Two. One. <laughs> now, don't oh, jeez. Form's looking good. You've got this. Come on. Not bad. <laughs> you two are doing awesome. <laughs> I knew you could do it. Your form's looking good. That's how it's done. 
Not bad at all. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Your form's looking good. Ah, shit. I do. Come on. I know you've got more to get. Not bad at all. That's how it's done. You've got this. Come on. Your form's not the best you can do. Ah, jeez. You've got this. Come on. Yeah. Do you have? Feel the burn. That's how it's done. Yeah. Not bad at all. That's how it's yeah. done. I knew you could do it. Yeah. Yeah. This one's much tougher. Much, much tougher. Yeah. What I tell you. It's it's hard to determine the, like the right rhythm because it speeds up. That's what's Come throwing on, me is off. Is that all you got? Let me see your fire! Those who sweat together get swole together! You can back out if you're scared. <laughs> I've got this! Come yeah. on! Your form's looking good! <laughs> You've got this! Come on! I knew you could do it! That's how it's looking good! Let me see you sweat! Not bad at all! That's how it's done! Your form's looking good! You've got this! Come on! I knew you have faith in you guys! You've got this! Come on! Your form's looking good! Not bad at all! That's how it's done! Your form's looking good! Yeah! Feel the burn! Not bad at all! You've got this! Come on! I knew you could do it! You've got this! Come on! That's how it's done. You two are doing awesome. Your form's looking good. I knew you could. Not bad at all. That's how it's done. Come on. Come on. Oh, 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 oh. come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Get up, get up, get up. Not bad at all. I knew you could do it. That's how it's done. Your form's looking good. I knew you could do it. Let me see you sweat. That's how it's done. You've got this. Oh, Come on. Shit. Not bad at all. Yes. Ooh. No. Okay. So I adjust the rhythm after each time I do the the fatigue gain. So the visual cue, so as I get the rhythm down, it disappears and I have to memorize it. So I have the visual cue when I reset or when it does the fatigue change. But afterwards, then I have to go based off memorization and rhythm. You did it. You really beat me. You got to be in incredible shape. <laughs> It's oh, you mean his you body, his animal. Yeah, that that's yeah, a little bit tough squat. because, well, maybe. Maybe. <laughs> oh, looks like this exercise? This is the, um, the final guy. Oh, jeez. I'll try. I'll, I'll, I'll try. I but something tells me this dude you. is going to be super freaking difficult. All right, let's go. Huh? Yeah. Woo! <laughs> You're better than yeah. I thought. Poetry in motion. So much yeah. training do you do? <laughs> yeah, Jewel. Show that city huh? how it's done. I believe in you. Huh? Who'd have thought it'd be this close? <laughs> you are huh? in the zone. Yeah. You can do it, Jules! We're rooting for you! Yeah. in motion! You're better than I thought! How yeah. much uh, yeah. training do you do? Yeah. Woo! Yeah. I can hear your muscles trying out and draw you yeah. yeah. be this close! I believe in you! Yeah. Woo! Yeah. You can't get enough of those beautiful you muscles! In the huh? You're better than I thought! Yeah. Poetry in motion! I believe in you! Yeah. Yeah. Oh man, who's gonna win yeah. this one? 
I was training you. You thought it'd be this. You are in the. Oh, dang it, dang it, dang it. Who'd have thought it'd be this close? Oh, no, no, no. Dang it! The thing is, when it gets faster and if you mess up, it, it messes you up. Like, you gotta start, like, from the slowest. That's the only thing. Oh, man, I almost had it. Up. You're way too dense. Like, you literally have to do this without messing up. <laughs> Let's you and me work up a sweat. I hope you're all warmed up. Because he doesn't, he only messed up, like, what, twice? So much training do you do? Poetry in motion. You can do it, Jules! We're rooting for you! You have to be this close. You are in the zone! I believe in you! Yeah, Jules! Show that pussy how it's done! Poetry in motion. Yeah. I believe in you! you are, yeah. I can't get enough of those beautiful muscles! Who'd have thought to be this close? How much training do you yeah. You're better than I thought. I can hear your muscles crying out and so I yeah. believe in you! You are in the yeah. How much training do you You're better than I thought. Oh man, who's gonna win this yeah. one? Who'd have thought to be this yeah. How much training do you You are in the You're better than I Yeah, cool! Show that sissy how yeah. I believe in you! Woo! Yeah. How much training? I thought it'd be better than I <laughs> Slow and steady! One, two, one, yeah. two! I believe in you! I yeah. thought it'd be better than I yeah. I can't get enough of those beautiful how muscles! How training? Yeah. Poetry and muscle! I believe in you! You are in the... <laughs> you can do it, Jules! We're yeah. rooting for you! Yeah. How much training? Woo! <laughs> Yeah. I don't know how you can recover Ooh. from that one. <sighs> Nothing to it. Second try, not too bad. I had no idea how strong you really were. You okay, really so pretty much once you? once you get the rhythm Listen down. Listen up, everyone. We can yeah. be stronger, better. Let's hit those weights. You got it, Jules. So yeah, it's just you adjust to the rhythm and you just keep that going. And then each time you do the fatigue switch, you just gotta, you know, remember at when the graphic comes up, get ready to do the the um, the rapid button press on X, and then just keep going with the rhythm. Not bad. Not bad. Alright, let's save. And then we'll keep going. Ooh. Yeah, the Sultan of Squat. <laughs> I like the uh um the, the sandlot reference. <laughs> All right. Let's see what this other task is. Let's see, where is it at? Oh, okay, that's over back towards the entrance. So now the number eight says, thanks for checking out that video. So hard to go all six minutes without a dumbass. Dude, like, that is very impressive because that is a long song and you, you played it all the way through. That was very impressive. Like, you've been so on the car. Yeah. You, you did really, really good. The angel would never. Oh, that, that is a long song. You're the new Merc looking for work in Wall Market. Maybe you can help us sort this out. 
Some criminals have stolen a shipment of donations bound for the Leaf House. The fiends. The culprit is none other than the notorious Angel of the Slums. People worship her as some kind of folk hero, but there's no denying she's the one that done did it. I mean, look at this calling card. The Garden Angle 3? Well, they must have meant to write Guardian Angel. Oh, come on, Garden Angle. Listen to me. I guarantee this is not the work of the Angel. I saw it with my own eyes. Three shady-looking types wandering around, scouting their mark, I bet. Well, if you're so sure, then bring them here. Prove to me this wasn't the work of your beloved Guardian Angel. You heard the man, Merc. I've got to find those thieves to clear the Angel's name, and I need your help to do it. She would never, ever do anything to harm the less fortunate. Find the three I saw and bring them here to me. They ran off toward the old expressway on the other side of Evergreen Park. All right, well, let's go get them. At least I know I got my materia pimped out. And I have plenty of items, so I'm not too worried. Where's the spot on the map? Oh, okay. So just got to make my way around. All right, let's go. <laughs> the Garden Angel strikes again, suckers. <laughs> Oh, these was one goobers. Card. Too easy. Just to you, Miss Angel, to what's killing you now. Hey, it's you! Bring it. What the hell are you doing coming after us? Shit! Play dead! Play dead! Shut up! It's too late for that! Bring it! We're ready for you this time! Wakey, wakey! Time to shine! <laughs> Check out this brick shit house. We picked him up at the Coliseum. Gonna pay you back double, nah, quadruple for what you've done to us. What's a triple? What are we doing? Is that right? Shut up! We're kicking Bondi's ass for being an ass! <laughs> These look like Gordon characters. <laughs> yeah, good boy. <laughs> Oh, you got some power. Okay. Pay attention. Let's see. What are you all about? Too bad. All weak against fire as well, too. <laughs> oh man. Never again. These guys are actually doing some damage. Guess I got oh, he just threw me. Really? Okay. No. Like to throw people. Just in case. That's it. Yeah, I got something for you. Come on now. You're coming with me. Well, they they gave it a good effort. I'll I'll, I'll give them that. They they gave it a good effort. Are the angels of the slums? 
Oh, man, you're real stupid! We're the Garden Angels! Get it right! Shut your trap, moron! Huh. You don't honestly think that the beloved Angel of the Slums could be any of these three idiots, do you? Nah, I recognize the masks. These guys are just small-time crooks who've been pestering folks around here for a minute. Should've listened to you earlier. Sorry about this. Well, you should be sorry. I'll consider us square, once you've taught these boys a lesson. Deal. Alright, get moving! Hey, watch it! Not so rough, you lummox! Yeah, you lummox, you lummox! Wow, and Butch is the dumbest one. So what about the donations? Do you need help taking them to the leaf house? Kind of you to offer, but I can manage on my own. I know these streets like the back of my hand. Better, even. It's the angel of the slums! She took the darn stuff! He's gonna be pissed! Well, I'll be seeing you. <laughs> Thanks to you, we can put this mess behind us. I'm grateful. The guardian angel of the slums. Radiant defender of the downtrodden? Huh. I wonder if I'm an accomplice. That's enough of that. Should probably get back to Madame M's. Ooh, but there's one more quest. Hold up, wait a minute. Oh, well, it's at the same place. Well, I don't know what it is. Step but... right up, step right up. <laughs> it's the fully Relax, automated man. state of the art. Relax. Let's let's Got see. <sighs> Why, hey there, champ. Got word from Madam M. She said you had time to kill before Aerith's ready for the big event. So, uh, what do you say to taking on a little extra work while you're waiting around? We've got a hell of a lot of fans clamoring to see their favorite champ go another round or ten. And something tells me they're not gonna rest until they see you kick ass again. Now get on down to the Coliseum ASAP! Oh, more Coliseum stuff. Okay. Okay, I, I, I think I can dig that. I think I can dig that. But first, let me reorganize. Let me reorganize my uh, materia, though. Let me get, let me get my materia right. Go see what this is all about. Oh, how am I looking on battle intel? Okay. Oh. Champ! You know what to do. Take the elevator and head on down. I can't wait to see you fight. All right. Let's see what we uh, see what we're dealing with. Special match. Stands are packed thanks to you. 
Now get out there and give him a show. All right. This challenger wanted another bite at the chance. One of Sam's favorite machines of mayhem, Cutty. Cutty. He's been sharpening his blades and dreaming of payback. Can our champ come out on top again? Fighters, begin! That's it. All right, let's see what you're all about. I got your number. We can't slide me. I think I replaced it with healing material, but that's okay. Ooh, okay. Kind of lame. Really? Jeez. <sighs> but that's partly my fault. I, I underestimated it. That is partly my fault. Yeah, that is partly my fault. Oh, okay, I did have lightning materia. Wow. Wow. Now it's really, really my fault. <laughs> wow. Here he is, the man of the hour. I, I feel bad now. Stands are packed thanks to you. Now get out there and give him a show. I totally gave that battle away. This challenger wanted another bite of the champ. One of Sam's favorite machines of mayhem, Cuddy. He's been sharpening his so blades and dreaming of payback. Like, and our champ come out on like top again? Now. Fighters, begin! All right, let's go. Oh, that did a lot of damage. Our champ stands victorious once more. Cloud wins. Cuddy's quest for sweet revenge has ended in bitter defeat. Dang. Well, <laughs> that's one way to come back and get this right. <laughs> Oh, what are Very you doing? Very nicely done. <laughs> Here's your cut. You earned it. Wait, you're here? What about Aerith? My people are working on her hair right now. I thought I'd take the opportunity to drop by and watch her match. 
I have to admit, I never get tired of seeing Sam's precious toys take a beating. <sighs> All right. I can tell by your hands you've come a long way. You've got the hands of a fighter who has found new purpose. A woman? Or two? I wonder. Just doing what I've always done. <laughs> anyway, Aerith should be finishing up soon. I'll go on ahead to check on her. Whenever you're ready, come back to the parlor. Cool. And I got an arcane scepter. Is that a new weapon for Aerith? I think so. Oh, yes, it is. <laughs> she seemed drunk. Who, uh, Madam M? Oh, I know. She's... Oh, no, she's freaking gorgeous. She kind of reminds me a little bit of uh, Lulu from Final Fantasy X. Leading familiar. Summon a fairy that attacks your enemies periodically as well as after you use abilities and spells. Ooh. Okay. Let's upgrade it first. <laughs> yeah, strong resemblance to, to Lulu. Yeah. Oh, no, she gave Cloud one heck of a massage, that's for sure. Goodness gracious. <laughs> Dang. Did 7,000 damage with that one Thundaga spell. Goodness gracious. I should, I should have done that the first time, but my dumb self. Folks watching, don't be don't be like me. I shouldn't, I shouldn't have lost that battle the first time. Just pure laziness here just underestimated got careless definitely want that new material slot yes new material slot yes All right, Sonata, I should be still around by the time you get back from your Smokes and Funyuns trip. Uh, let's see. Da, 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 da. Ooh, new material slots. Yes, yes. Not as strong, but hey, it's another, it's another good weapon. It does look cool, though. I ain't gonna lie. Alrighty, sounds good. Um, Sonata number eight says, "If I miss you, have a good weekend, man. Stay safe." Cool deal. You too. You too. All right, I got that settled pretty much. Let's see, does this guy have any more bat fights? Hey, been waiting for you. So, what are you in the mood to fight? Oh, okay. Oh, so it was pretty much just Come that one battle. Come back anytime you want to fight. Yeah, it's pretty much just that one battle. Okay. 
fair enough. I kind of want to redo my materia now. Oh yeah, she she has an extra slot. Oh, I guess you could have the magic up. Let's go back to Aerith. Just to make sure there's no other quests. It was just the it was just those three. Oh, okay. Fair enough. Okay, let's go back to the um, to the parlor. You don't have anything, do you, uh, Chadley? I hope you will continue to help me gather vital information for my research. Yeah, I didn't think so. Yeah, I didn't think I look so. forward to receiving all of your future battle intel submissions. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Whoa, whoa. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> Take a deep breath. What about Tifa? I heard Corneo was gonna audition new girls soon. And Tifa's... Tifa's gonna be... I just... I, I don't know what to do. Well, I do. I'll come too! Hey, Cloud! Bro! I can call you bro, right? Nope. Rescue Tifa. Just wanna say, bro, that I'm totally relieved that you're looking out for Tifa. So, like, how'd you get so strong anyway, bro? I said... The way you fight, bro, is like poetry and violence. Bam, bam, whoosh, whoosh, you know? I really wish I could be just like you. My problem is that I tend to overthink and overanalyze everything. So, bro, do you have any advice for a smart, stand-up guy like myself? Uh, I can't help you there. Well, this is it for me. Call me crazy, but, uh... I have a feeling that I'll just be getting in the way. Go find Aerith at Madame M's. Tell her to wait for me there when she's done. 
Think you can handle that? Yes, sir. Oh, okay. I have no idea what to expect, so let me save it. Cause I I have no idea what to expect. Again. Got a letter of approval right here. Hmm? You know that's only good for women, right? Yeah, it's for Aerith. Who? Oh, that girl you were with. Sorry to hear that. Well, either way, you're stuck out here, pal. I can't let you in. I wasn't asking for permission. Huh? Wouldn't try it if I were you. Trust me, you don't want to screw with the Don. If you even think about causing any trouble, he'll make sure someone pays for it. And that someone might wind up being the girl you're trying so hard to break out. Or it could wind up being someone you've never even met before. Get it? You're in the Don's world now. Anyway, you've got some time yet. The audition won't start for a while. If you're sure you want to go through with this, then bring the girl and the letter. But if I were you, I wouldn't. Well, <laughs> guess that didn't work. is so gaudy and impossible to move in. Uh, 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 yeah. Cloud? Uh, <clears throat> excuse me. Huh. Hey, wait a minute. Did Johnny forget to give you my message? The one asking me to stay put? No, I got it. I was worried about you. I'm starting to think this place is more dangerous than we thought. Who knows what they'll ask you to do in this audition. No way in hell I'll let you go in there by yourself. By myself? Oh, don't worry. I wasn't gonna. Come on, you'll see. See what, exactly? Uh -oh. According to Madam M, you've caught the eye of a certain fabulous someone, and they'd like to meet in person. Huh? She is rocking that dress, though. I ain't gonna lie. She is rocking that dress. I mean... <laughs> I mean, I know this is nothing like it was in the original, but she... Aerith is rocking that dress. I don't know how the heck she can run like this in heels, but... Whatever. Dang. Hey there, cutie. Where are you headed? Why don't you let me buy you a cup of coffee? I never done it again. Yes. 
That's a dress. I tell you, red is definitely Aerith's color, that's for sure. You are like the beautiful flower. Tifa's got some competition. I'm just, I'm just letting you know. Aww. Why are we here? Oh, here we go. To see the honeybee ends Andrea Rodea and convince him to give you his stamp of approval. Oh, you said you didn't want me going alone, right? Well, with Andrea's help, you can join me. It'll be fun. And honestly, I think you'll look pretty cute in a dress. Oh, God. What? It's pretty rare for Andrea to take a personal interest in someone. At least, that's what Madame M said. Trust me, this is gonna work out great. Uh... Come on! Don't you want to save Tifa? Wait. No can do, Cloud. This is our plan, and you'll learn to love it. So, here's how I think we should approach him. Madame M said Andrea was a man who'd give anyone a fair chance to win him over. So I say we march right up to him, explain the situation, and see where that gets us. Sound good? The audience is part of the court. I guess. Come on! Don't you want to save Tifa? But of course, I knew this was coming. I mean, come on now. Hey, are you nervous too? Good evening. Welcome to the entertainment extravaganza that is the Honey Bee Inn. We're here to see Andrea Rodea. You must be Mr. Cloud. He's waiting for you. Mr. Cloud? I've been instructed to send you through without delay, sir. Please, make your way to the stage in the back. What stage? The one in the back, sir. Straight through those doors and down the hall. Hmm. Oh, there's different rooms. Cool. Hey there. Watch the stinger, sweetie. <laughs> what shape am I making? Mm. <gasps> this circle? Wow. Uh, huh? Who's there? Uh, uh, whatever. I'm having trouble seeing this thing. What's the answer? I couldn't even tell. Uh, you know what? You're useless. I couldn't even tell, <laughs> to be honest with you. Oh, I get you. You want to go for round two. Wait, do it again? Oh. Ding, 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 ding. That's a right answer, baby. <laughs> you did it, boyo. I'm so damn proud of you. Huh? You still here? But why? Whatever. That was really weird. But whatever. I guess I'm done with you. <laughs> hey there, doll face. We've been waiting for you. Come on in. Have a seat. No, I'm not here for... Huh? Oh, wait a minute. I think you might have wandered into the wrong room by mistake. You would have been a fun distraction. Okay. Whatever. <laughs> but now I'm in debt. Oh, that's the go back out. Andrea shows transcend beauty and entertainment. Oh god. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna get ya! Oh, jeez, it's Palmer. Oh my god. 
looks like he needs some help. <laughs> He's out of breath. Wow. I guess that's it. Wow. That's all I'm gonna say. <laughs> all weird, but it's the, it's the honeybee that's supposed to be weird, I guess. And Great here's ladies. the man of the hour, chosen by Andrea himself, our honored guest. Jeez. Oh, man. Let me take a bite of this butterfinger. All right, let's go. This is your first time, right? It's okay. Do you want to practice your dance moves first? Why would I want to do that? Andrea thought it might be a good idea. Over here. Come on now. Hey, hold on. <laughs> oh, I got to dance. Oh, Jesus. Um, press the buttons and time to the music using the rhythm line as a guide. The colors and button positions on the guide panel show you which buttons to press. Watch the button positions closely and get ready to press them when the panel and the line are right on top of each other. Oh, okay. <laughs> Delicious! Mister, move over, girls. A new dancer's come to town. That was the lamest thing ever. That that's supposed to be dancing? Are you, are you freaking kidding me? Wow. No, I'm totally not doing that again. Come on, come on. The show's about to start. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> my, my. Is that Cloud? Oh, Jesus. Mm. Darling, I had no idea. <laughs> oh. Mm. Oh. <laughs> you? Well, you just sit tight until Andrea takes the stage. Look at his muscles. Aw, oh, he's flushing. <laughs> what have I got myself into? Life can be hard, it can be bitter, but we can make it all so sweet. Here at the honeybee, in every moment is a treat.
Welcome to the Humvee in there, Cloud. You seek my approval, dude. I understand. Oh, no, no, no. But those who crave my favor must first prove that they know how to move. You don't have a choice. <laughs> you stuck. <laughs> Think you can follow my lead? Maybe. Yes, I will transform you into a vision of beauty. Now, without further ado, let us begin!
True beauty is an expression of the heart. A thing without shame, to which notions of gender don't apply. Don't ever be afraid of that. That show today blew my mind! Did you drink Just tonight? Come over I here. can't help I'll it. Buy it you was a amazing. Drink. We can talk. Was it planned from the start? Probably not. Did you see their little surprise? That was a show. Cloud. I know that's you. You who? Cloud. Hello. You're just gonna keep. Please don't. Not a word. Not even one? No! <laughs> but you're so pretty! But, I, I get it though. It, it, it's in the original. I, I get it. But, oh man, they really, they really took it other levels of this. They, they really did. They, they, You know what? I just thought of something. I just thought of something. I wonder, you think maybe if I went through the alleys, I could get, oh, I'm gonna try that. I'm gonna try this. One nice magnificent plus, man. Will it let me? No, it won't. Yeah, that'll be no. one to remember. Dang, I was thinking maybe I'd be able to get through the side by side the with another beautiful flower. Time to go home. Oh well. Come on, fire. Hey, little lady, are you all right? Anyway, let's let's do this. Whoa! He's in the car. It's the girl of my dreams. The most beautiful girl in the world. Wait a minute! Yeah, that is one hot chick. <laughs> Somebody just said, oh, that is one hot chick. Huh? You're planning on fighting in that getup? <laughs> I don't know about that. Excuse me, miss, but are you sure you're in the right place? Well, at least the dude know, knows it's me, so at least, I mean, that's, I guess that's reassuring. Alright. I guess, let me, I guess let me save it. Oh my god. Uh. Well, at least I didn't have to get in the hot tub with all the scantily clad men. <laughs> at least I, at least I didn't have to do that part. <laughs> oh man. Oh, that's that's gonna blind me for a bit. Oh god. No way. Here you are. Letters from Andrea Rodea and Madam M. That ought to do the trick, right? You serious? Is there a problem? I hope you know what you're in for. Oh, we'll be fine. If you say so. Come on. Wow. He actually let me in. Shoot, in the original, he would flip out Leon. Oh, your friend is hot. You and your friend. Please, come on in. The two of you here for the audition? Second floor, at the very end of the walk. And don't go poking your nose in where it doesn't belong.
Welcome to the mansion of the esteemed Don Cornea. Rooms on the second floor, at the very end of the walk. That one's Madame M's girl, ain't it? Man, she's not. Hey, hands to yourself. We've been waiting for you to show. That Andrea's girl? I'd let her do things to me. Go wow. to your room and wait. Quiet. Room's at the end. Keep walking. Gas. Uh, uh, oh crap. Come on. Damn it. Oh no. Cloud. Hey, pretty ladies, too. Feeling a little lightheaded? Really? Let's say we escort you to the parlor so you can make yourself more comfortable. Let's get this show on the road. Where are you taking us? Come on now. Let's see, Daisy. Hey, 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 You want to throw down the Corneo curve? So if you leave a mark on him, you ain't getting off with him. I know. Man, it's starting to get some real lookers this time, Daisy. You know what I'm saying? Tifa. Oh, Tifa? Hello. Yes? You okay? Mm-hmm. Good. Wait a minute. Cloud? Is that you? Oh my god, that makeup! And that dress! Nailed it, I know, thank you. Moving on. <laughs> <laughs> Ah, there's Aerith. Okay. You good? We're all together, at least. Yeah, bit woozy, but I'll manage. <sighs> hey, Tifa. How you doing? Uh, okay. Oh, right. I'm Aerith. A friend of Cloud's. We were worried and thought we'd come help you out. Uh, thanks? Cut the chatter. We gotta leave. Huh? Right now. Uh, no! Not until I've got what I came for. What? So... After we made it back to the slums, some guys came around asking all kinds of questions. So I did some digging. And found out they were Corneo's men. Right. They were interested in Avalanche. But I couldn't figure out why. So I thought I'd come and ask the man himself. Seriously? Thought if I could find a way in and get some one-on-one -on -one time. But then I realized I'd only be one of three candidates. And that if he didn't pick me, it would all be for nothing. Then your worries are over, aren't they? Because the other two candidates are right here. Right? Uh, right. So yeah, <laughs> if we're all in on it, then nothing can go wrong. Uh, I guess not. You? Me? Cloud? Makes no difference who gets chosen, does it? I don't know, Aerith. It feels wrong getting you involved in all this. Don't even bother trying to talk her out of it. Oh, Cloud gets me. Took you long enough. <sighs> ah, so what happens now? I think they'll call for us when it's time. This room gives me the creeps. Oh, what is this? Oh, jeez, really?
get another HP up. I'll get one more for now. get another uh, I can get another HP up yeah. Alright, let's save and let's keep going. So, got the ladies in my party now. Ooh. The ladies, listen up! I'm sure you're still feeling a bit woozy, but tonight's audition's about to begin. Head out the door to the left and up the stairs. Come on, ladies. Let's hustle. All right, guys. Let's do this. <laughs> do you want to do this? Oh, man. Here we go. Anything else around here? <clears throat> Say out of all three. Okay, mm, that's my tough. beautiful ladies, time to line up for the dawn. Because I like Tifa's outfit a lot, but Aerith is rocking the mess out of that outfit. Mm -hmm. Wait, you look kind of familiar. We haven't met before, have we? Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Uh, whatever. All right. I'm surprised you can't notice that that's Eric. Let's do this thing. That's kind of sad. Introducing Walmart's most eligible bachelor, the one and only Don Corneo. Lady. <sighs> Voiced by Mark Hamill. Nice. Very nice. <laughs> Whichever one shall I pick? <laughs> oh, gee. Oh. Shall I pick you? <laughs> or maybe you? Yeah. <laughs> oh, jeez. Just don't pick me. Oh yeah! I've got it! I've got it! Today's bride to be is... Today's? And tomorrow's, or the day after's, if the dawn takes a shine to you. Pathetic. Huh? Hey, which one of you said that? Was it you? Yep. You got a mouth on you. I'm going to enjoy breaking it in. Today's lucky lady is the big bone girl. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> Still playing hard to get? I can dig it. Oh, yeah. Oh, my God. 
Leftovers are all yours. Yeah! yeah. Okay. <laughs> okay, ladies. Y'all come with me. Don't be shy, little kitten. Shimmy on over and give daddy some sugar. Oh no need to play coy. Nobody here but you and me. Oh, you're even cuter than I thought. Back off. Ooh! <laughs> this kitten's got claws! I love it! <laughs> what was that? Don't you worry, your pretty little head. Just a picture to preserve the moment. And to ensure you don't do anything inappropriate like say no. Asshole. Oh, praise me more! <laughs> Hey, yo, fellas! We got guests, and y'all got first crack at entertaining them. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Courtesy of the ever generous Don Corneo himself, never forget the Don provides. Yeah. Corneo! <laughs> so, ladies, ready to. Get to it? Yeah. I guess I'm good to go whenever. How about you, Tifa? Mm. Four guys between us. Okay. Let's not keep Cloud waiting. Right. Wait. I know you. The Coliseum! <laughs> what the hell? Get down! <laughs> <laughs> uh, don't you stupid! Wait! Good job, lady. Good job, Eric. It was nothing compared to you. Well, Andrea filled me in on the situation. I come bearing gifts with you. Oh. I'll do what I okay. can to clean this up. Just finish the job. Uh, thank you! Appreciate it. Okay, let's go rescue Cloud. Corneo's room, right? Wow, I didn't think I'd actually end up controlling them. Better hurry. Better hurry. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Man, I'd love to spend some quality time with because like that. I want to see what's in the other room right now. Lucky bastard. What's in the other room? Items? Okay, we're out. Unless... Oh. Alright, never mind. Alright, to Cloud we go. What are you doing here? <laughs> hey, hey, you the reset? What? You can do it! I got you! I guess. You're up! I'll show you what I can do. What do you think of this trick? <laughs> oh, that's cool. No surprises there. Oh, that leads back to underground. Wasn't there another... There's another room in here, I thought. Wasn't there? Isn't there another room in here? I guess it doesn't open. Never mind.
we go. <laughs> Don't stop! Tell me what you a bad boy I bastard. am! <laughs> yes, yes I am! Here I come, baby! Yeah. <laughs> oh. <laughs> <laughs> hey, who the hell gave you permission to do that? One of you get in here and teach this bitch some manners! Sorry, but your boys had to learn some manners too. What the? Cloud, your clothes! <laughs> oh? So you're a man, huh? What are you three up to? We'll ask the questions. Like, why'd you have men in Sector 7 asking about Avalanche? Nah. Huh? Don't know what you're talking about. Don't play dumb with me. Let's try again. Why did you have men in Sector 7 asking about Avalanche? Spill the beans, or... I'll cut them off. All right, all right, I'll talk, I'll talk! <laughs> uh, some guy with a gun for an arm! I was paid to find him! Paid by who? I can't tell you that! They'd hunt me down like a dog! Well, you better. Cause if you don't, I'll rip them off! Oh, jeez. <laughs> <laughs> It was the director of public security, Heidegger! It was Heidegger! Shinra! And what were they planning? Some things are better left unsaid, you know? See, I'm not so sure they are. Better keep talking. Or I'll smash them. <laughs> <laughs> Just like the original. <laughs> All right, you got me. I could never say no to a sexy girl. Since Avalanche blew up two reactors, Shinra's decided they ought to stamp them out, home base and all. And I mean, stamp out. By targeting the support pillar and blowing it up. The pillar? Yep. Did I stutter? The plate will come crushing down. <laughs> It'll be Sector 6 all over again. I'm sure you've been there and seen the wreckage for yourself. So you know exactly what Sector 7's gonna look like. They wouldn't. Come on, guys. We gotta go. Before you do... No. Please, this won't take long. As everyone knows, villains only divulge their plans in a certain situation. But what is that situation? When they've lost their minds. Oh. oh, I'm sorry. Time's up. The answer lies below in the sewers. <laughs> 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 Enjoy the sights and smells! <laughs> Very well done, Mark Hamill. Very well done. Did a great job. I can dig dig Mark Hamill as uh, Don Corneo. I dig it. All right. Are we on the schedule? <laughs> the Turks are on top of it. Yes, there will be no delays. Please, Mr. President. I am asking you to reconsider. No, begging. The Sector 7 Undercity is home to more than 50,000... <sighs> Director Twisty. At least let us issue a warning, sir. The stench of the director's cowardice fills the room yet again. <clears throat> Breathe. Progress requires sacrifice. 
Learn to live with it. <clears throat> Chapter 10, Rough Waters. Damn it, Reeks. Aerith. Uh, Cloud. We have to get to Sector 7. Yeah.
Probably Corneo's pet. And we were dinner. <laughs> hey, you don't believe that crazy story of his, do you? Shinra wouldn't sacrifice a whole sector just to take out Avalanche, would they? Destroying part of the city, killing all those people just to get at us? <laughs> You'd be surprised. I don't know. Is Corneo the kind of guy who'd make up shit just to screw with you? I wouldn't put it past him. <laughs> but if he was telling the truth, hmm? and there's still a chance he was, isn't there, then we should go. And if it turns out he was lying, then so what? Right? Mm. Hmm? Uh, uh, Tifa! Jeez, does she have I to run it. off like that? These tunnels are all connected. What oh, you said there's no gas I'm stations sure we open? Can use these oh, tunnels to make our way back to Sector 7. The sewers under Sector 6 and 7 should be connected. If you get in trouble, just follow the stench. Another one of those lessons? An avalanche saying, actually. We use them to move around the Undercity, in emergencies. Sure we're not lost? Positive. There should be a big waterway just up ahead. Let's find that place. Lead the way. Oh, you're more upset about the Funyuns than the cigarettes. Sucks when you're not able to procure the snacks you want. Do I need to... Um, I need to get some curing done. Oh yeah. You're dead. Oh. Look at me. Get him. Best you were right. With this fire, of course. Not bad. <laughs> A lot of damage. Jeez. Oh yeah, I can upgrade as well. Let's go with... Thank you. 
right, let's keep going. Here though, what we got. Ooh, feathered gloves. And well, what do you know? Tifa gets another weapon. Star Shower. Unleash a flurry of powerful strikes. Increase the strength of mechs. Execute a command. Ooh. Wow. Okay. Let's, let's upgrade this. So I would lose, I would lose one slot, but that's okay. Um, which slot would I be losing? The luck one, or the poison one? Uh, I don't need the poison.
Okay. Let's save and let's go a little bit further. Just just a little bit further. Just like that, okay? I got gotcha. you. That wasn't too bad. Anything over there? Alrighty, Sonata number eight. That's thanks for checking in. You rest well and enjoy your weekend. See you, see you soon. Okay. Oh, I got two ways to go. Is it safe to go through here? It's really dark. I'm sure we'll be fine. Come on. Hey, Cloud. Assuming Corneo was telling us the truth, what do you think Shinra's really up <coughs> to? I mean, they've got to have an endgame. But I can't imagine what it is. Destroying a whole chunk of the city just to get back at us doesn't make any kind of sense. Yeah, I can't imagine any way they could profit from it. It's gonna cost them a fortune to rebuild. Corneo's lying. He's gotta be. Guys like him do it all the time out of habit. dark area.
what's over here. Oh, there's another dark area. circle, but it's okay. I meant to do that. I wanted to see what the deal was. Oh, okay, I'm like, where's Tifa? That's a power generator, all right. Wow, talk about ancient. It's an antique, older than the Mako reactors even. It'd be a miracle if it still works. Well, let's try. Actually scared them. Keep it together. I'm coming. Back me up, okay? <laughs> Nothing Jeez, to it. That scared the crap out of me. I never thought a jump scare from a Final Fantasy game would get me, but it got me. That's the key to um to that that door that one door. Yeah, I think it might be a, a key to that to that one door that I couldn't that I couldn't unlock. Where, where was it? Yeah, it was back here. Yeah, 
Nautilus. And over here. This isn't it? should be just on the other side of this waterway. So this is where Sector 6 ends. And where Sector 7 begins. Once we cross over, we can start looking for a way back to the surface. Might be harder than you think. Let's just try to make our way down this tunnel. See if we can't use those gates to clear a path. We can do this. We'll figure it out. Yeah, for sure. Okay. Way 
to do it. Oh, there's a particular enemy over there. First, okay. Damn it. I can't stop thinking about what Corneo said. I know. Me too. It's gotta be a trick. There's no way they'd go that far. But but what if Corneo really was telling the truth? We have to get there in time to stop it. We have to. not telling me huh uh. guys come on we got to keep moving coming I'll go first mm. <sighs> careful Aerith. okay Aerith. your turn on my way here we go She's gonna fall. She's totally gonna fall. She's gonna fall. We're almost there. Jump! That was close. Thanks. You saved me. <laughs> Least I could do. Hear that, Cloud? Mm -hmm. Come on. Okay. 
over there. Focus. Oh, well, we made it across. Still thinking about the plate? Yeah. The future isn't set in stone. That's what I always tell myself. Yeah. I hope you're right. How about this then? Think of something fun. After saving Sector 7, you're gonna... I'm gonna... Go shopping. Topside. I'll buy stuff for the bar. Decorations. Coasters. Can I come? You'd better. Then it's a date. <laughs> <laughs> Cloud can carry all our stuff. He'll be our pack, Chocobo. <laughs> what was that about me? Nothing. <laughs> huh? Oh no. Huh? No way! <laughs> Come on, Tifa! Cloud! <laughs> Hold on tight! On three, okay? <laughs> One, two, three! <laughs> Sorry about that. No need to be. <sighs> Try to be more careful, y'all. Jeez. Finished up at the wall market, got all dressed and dolled up, we saved Tifa, we fought Ab Abzu, and yeah, got a lot done, got a lot done, um, but that will do it, that will do it for this, this part, um, hopefully in the next part we can get out of the sewers and, um, meet up with Barrett and go from there. But anyway, thank y'all so much for watching. This is Blitzball Champ signing off. Have a blessed weekend. I'll see y'all soon. Peace.